Dude. Okay. All right, I'm going to get the camera back in it. you and be your cameraman. Bunny hopping. I love the black shows. Oh, I'm not very good. You guys, let's go, let's go. So we're gonna bunny hop. No, nah, we're not gonna bunny hop yet. We're gonna pop wheelies first. Yes. I already know. Listen, guys. Listen. I want to get half of you guys right here where I am, and the other half on the other side. Let me go grab my bike. Yeah, grab your bike. <laughs> All right. So half right here. Half over there, facing the middle, right here. I know right, how to wheelie. Come on, guys. I've done a wheelie before. Have you? I seen you pop one right there. That's a good one. Oh, darn now, it. I'm going to show you how to do that better than Okay, line up over there on the side, face the middle. Stay, stay out of the middle, line up over here like I am, either over there or over here. Line up! All right. Line up over here. I can do a wheelie pretty easily. Okay, is everybody here? Almost. Okay, now we're going to move right along. Sub to me and him. <laughs> I'm not recording, my camera's off my head. I know. My camera's gone. My camera's gone. Okay, now, here we go. We're moving on now. Uh, we're going to carry on learning some more skills because, you know, most of you guys ride, most of you are pretty new. So, what you're going to have to focus on for a long time is your skills. we got to keep you guys safe out here. A lot of you guys are just, you don't have the basic skills of getting over the jump, so you get yourself in trouble pretty easy. 
Now, what I want for you guys, most of you are pretty new, I want you to ride your bikes a lot, everywhere you can ride it, whether it's riding in your neighborhood, or an empty parking lot, or you have a skate park in town, or a bike park, uh, your track is great, but you need to ride your bikes a lot. That's the only way you're going to get better, okay? And it's going to take a long time, but who cares? I've done it on the skateboard. Right? Fun. So, we're going to talk about some skills that you can work on where you don't even have to come to the track. You can do them in your neighborhood, you know, in the driveway, on the sidewalk, whatever. We're going to talk about wheelies and bunny hops. Now, understand, no matter where you ride your bike and no matter what you do, you learn on your bike. When you ride in the neighborhood, everything you learn, all the skills that you get better at on your bike, you're going to make you a better racer. So don't think the only time you practice for racing Every time you ride your bike, you practice for the racing, okay? Now, I'm going to show you guys a couple different wheelies. There's a beginner wheelie, there's a middle wheelie, and then there's a wheelie for the more advanced riders, okay? And I'll show you all three. You're going to have to remember which one is which, and they're all different, and you have to do them all differently. So when you're going to pop your wheelie, you have to remember which one you want to do. You have to remember they all have their own little technique, okay? Now, wheelie number one. This is for beginners. This is where we all start. When we learn to pop wheelies, it's very simple. It's not super fancy, but who cares? It's where we begin and we work our way up from there. Okay, so all we have to do to pop a little wheelie, we're going to approach the start for us. Is gonna be right there where those blocks are. All you have to do to pop a wheelie, you got to use a little bit of muscle and a little bit of body movement. Okay, and here's how we do it. We're going to approach, and we're going to approach with our pedals level. You're going to pop this wheelie, you got to have your pedals level so you have good balance. Now we're going to approach, pedals level. All you have to do to pop a wheelie is squat down with your legs, and then you're going to spring up with your legs and pull up with your arms at the same time. All right, so it's real simple. Check it out. Approach, pedals level, squat, free lift. Squat, free lift. Super simple. Okay, now, one thing I have to tell you. When you guys start popping wheelies, anytime, I don't know if I'm getting eaten or what, anytime your front wheel comes off the ground, whether you're popping a wheelie or bunny hopping or jumping, if your front wheel turns, fellas, 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 scoot up a little bit. Please pay attention. I'm trying to keep you from looking like me, and I'm going to show you something gross. Um, anytime your front wheel comes off the ground, whether it's popping a wheelie, doing a bunny hop, or jumping, if it turns in the air, whether on purpose or accident, you got to do your very best to get it back straight before it comes back down. Because if you land with a crooked wheel and you're going fast, <coughs> chances are you're going to eat it. You're going to flip over the handlebars. Now, I show every clinic my wrist. I have a wrist. It's fused. It doesn't bend anymore. It just sits there like that. It doesn't bend. Why? It, because I crashed in a wheelie going really fast. My handlebars turned. My front wheel dropped down, and when it did and it hit the ground, I flipped off the jump down into an asphalt turn. I got scars on every side of my wrist from surgeries. I've had six surgeries on this wrist, and finally they just fused it. They made it not bend anymore. But the coolest scar is the big jagged one on the side, and that's where the bone was poking out when I was laying there in the turn. I don't want anyone else to feel what I felt that day. So make sure, especially if you're trying to be fancy, turning the wheel in the air, you better turn it back straight before you land. So let that be a lesson for you, okay? So make sure you keep your wheel straight. Now, okay, I showed you wheelie number one. That's for the real little guys and chicks and the beginners. Now, wheelie number two, when you get a little older, a little stronger, you were kind of doing it a while ago. We're gonna start, we're gonna do a stand-up pedal wheelie. Now, when you get good at the stand-up pedal wheelie, you can go all the way down the block. Now, I'm not sure how good I'm gonna be at this because I have a knee right now that needs to have surgery. But uh, I can't have surgery till the end of the year. So I'm going to do my best to show you. Now, the stand-up pedal wheelie, it's a little different. So I saw you. You were starting with your pedals level, and then you did a real fast back pedal to start your wheelie. You want to start this one. If you just chill with your pedals up and down, it's a lot easier to start your wheelie. So check it out. When you're going to start, that's only for the pedal wheelie. Start with the pedals up and down. To get that front wheel up, it's pretty simple. You're going to pull up on the bars, take your shoulders back, and push with that top foot. Pull up, shoulders back, push. You see how easy my front wheel comes up? 
See, when you do that back pedal thing, you're just super busy. It's just too rushed. But if you start here chilling, you just pull up, shoulders back, push through the front foot. Now, if you want to keep that front foot up, if you want to keep that wheelie going, all you want to do, keep your shoulders back. So you're standing up pretty tall. Keep those shoulders back and keep pushing as the top foot comes around, push, push, push. That's it. And if you have your shoulders back, what's gonna happen, that front wheel's gonna come back to you. You don't wanna lean over the front end and try to hold your front wheel up. It's not gonna work very good. You wanna lean back so the, so the front wheel comes back to you. Now, I always keep my finger on the brakes. In case it comes up too high, I grab the brakes. If your front wheel comes up too high, don't keep pedaling. You gotta stop pedaling. Now, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do this wheelie or not, because I'm not sure if my right leg is gonna come around very good, but I'm gonna try it for you guys. Pretty simple once you, once you get that first one down. So remember, we're gonna approach with the pedals up and down. You're gonna pull up, shoulders back, push through the front foot. My right leg doesn't wanna to work too good, but Remember, pull up, shoulders back, push through the top foot as it comes around. Simple as that. And if you've got a nice flat street, you can go all the way down the street. Brock, Brock. Oh, see, I got a little worried. I grabbed the brakes, and that's what they're for. Whoa, you got to try to keep the balance. And it's as simple as that. It takes a lot of, it takes some practice. But remember, you can't hold your body weight up. Stand up tall with the shoulders back. Keep pushing on the front foot. If the front wheel comes up too high, grab the brakes. Now, that's wheelie number two. Now, for you couple of expert guys, what do you think is wheelie number three? 